Would you mind if I touched, if I kissed, if I held you tight in the morning light? Yeah. Would you mind if I said how I felt in the lead tonight? Again, cause I never ever felt this way in my heart before. Oh, love has found its way in my heart tonight. Mm. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, family. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the mental house with your host, Khadija. Y'all already know, I'm, I'm, my heart is heavy er. <laughs> you know, life is something. And that's why you got to cherish every moment of it. That's why you don't have time. You don't have time for nothing. <laughs> but to be the best whoever you are that you can be before you leave here. And leave something. And leave something that we all can take with us. And appreciate you for being on the planet for it. So y'all already know I'm coming with a heavy heart, but I'm coming with a great thank you. I'm coming with a great, great, great sense of gratitude for my brother who has passed on now and is now an ancestor, Brother Maurice White, the great songwriter, percussionist from my favorite band, the greatest band of all times, Earth, Wind, and fire. Yes, Maurice uh, passed away uh, in Los Angeles on um, yesterday, I believe, which was the maybe the third of. Uh, he was seventy-four years old. He died in his home, and of course, most of us know that you know Maurice had got off off the circuit, you know, for a while because he had been suffering from a Parkinson's disease and. So he long stopped traveling and singing with the band, but Maurice White is Earth, Wind & Fire. Earth, Wind & Fire was Maurice White's vision. And as you can see, I can hardly um, talk about Maurice or Earth, Wind & Fire without having a big fat lump in my throat. So trying to get past that so I can tell you an Earth, Wind & Fire story. No. A Maurice White story. <laughs> um, but I think that Maurice is one of the premier band leaders, musicians that the world has ever, ever, ever seen. And, you know, it would, of course, there's only one Maurice. And Maurice's mission and objective was to get people to be the best that they could be, to see themselves on a higher level, to get into the spirituality of oneself. That's what Maurice was all about. And he used the gift of music to unite people from all around the world. I'm gonna tell a quick Maurice story. And then, I'm going to get off of this computer because, again, I am really touched by the passing of my brother right across his hometown of Chicago. So, um, I consider him my homeboy, Brother Maurice White. I'm going to tell y'all Maurice White's story. In about um, 1975, I'm, of course, I'm dating y'all, but if y'all don't know by now, I'm 56 years old. So, uh, you know, I 
We got a lot of history here, okay? <laughs> it ain't like I just popped out. In fact, one of the next videos that I'm going to do, I think I'm going to introduce myself. Because a lot of y'all don't really know who the hell I am. Just some crazy lady in the mental house that do mental things. So, I think I owe that to all of uh, y'all there. And then maybe y'all can tell me a little bit about you, okay? Since we in the house together. <laughs> um, But 19, I think it was 75, I was like 16. Yeah, I was like 16 years old. And, um, yeah. So this album was out. And it was called Fast the Way of the World. Okay. I had already been familiar, of course, with Earth, Wind, and Fire. Because, where have all the flowers gone? Long time passing. Where have all the flowers gone long ago? I mean, them, them boys was cold. So, um, I'm certainly familiar with Maurice White, okay? And Earth, Wind, and Fire. That's my jam. So, I was in Chicago, and um, I think we were well, going to perform at some little rinky dink, some club. I don't remember what was going on. But we were in the hotel, and I was about to get in the elevator, and who do you think was in the elevator? Um, when I stepped in, you know how you get into the elevator, I stepped in, I think it was like the McCormick's in, or, I, you know, I really don't remember, I don't know, what, it's like, it's been a while ago. But anyway, I got into the elevator, and he was in there with uh, the the heavy set guitar player, I think his name was Al, Al McKay, and um, do 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 um, uh, Don Myrie, who's from Los Angeles. Rest in peace, Don, because I was just heard that he passed away um, a couple years back, and I didn't, I wasn't aware of that. But rest in peace. So I walked into the elevator and I saw these guys, and because I am in love with Maurice White. And he was like such a prolific songwriter um, to me just then. We hadn't even got to the other stuff yet. We ain't even got to uh, Boogie Wonderland. Okay, because I was just uh, right out the gate. <laughs> and when I saw him in the elevator, y'all, I said, and I swear, nothing came out. Nothing came out. It's the first time. I had been starstruck in my life when I saw Maurice White. And um, I'll never forget it. He kissed me in the middle of my forehead. He probably said, this is sick. Bro. Anyway, he kissed me in the middle of the forehead. And um, they got off on the floor. I can't even remember. I was just... I was in, I was in heaven, such heaven, <laughs> it was incredible, and um, you know, my band members teased me about it, they had teased me about it for so much because they knew how much uh, Maurice White meant to me in Earth, Wind, and Fire, and to see him in the elevator, and to um, have him do that, it just showed you the spirit and the warmth, he just was such a warm man warm human being so in honor of maurice white i'm so thankful for all the music that you've left us i'm so thankful i'm so grateful that you i was on the earth at the same time in the same space that you were on god and um your music will live on forget forever uh, my condolences to your family uh, and um, all the fans all across the world who love Maurice White. I know today we are mourning his passing, but he left, left us an archive of music and hits and just a collection, a catalog of, of music and songs that appeal to us on a divine spiritual level. Thank you, Brother Maurice. Thank you for using your time and getting the most out of your musicianship. 
while you was on the planet. Thank you for living on purpose. Thank you. Because now the whole world is dancing to your music. Shining star for you to see what your life can truly be. Shining star for you to see what your life can truly be. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, y'all. If you like what you hear, please like and subscribe. Leave your comments below. I would love to hear you. I know sometimes it takes me a long time to get to them. I try to answer each and every one. It might take me a minute, but I'll get there. Thank y'all for being there, and I appreciate you being in the mental house with me. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye-bye.